I did a thing. I bought a car. <laughs> It was really unexpected as my goal was to buy my car for a birthday present i just wanted to go look at the car to see if i liked it and just check it out once i got there it was literally the car i wanted and it had everything i wanted that i just ended up buying it but i've ordered a lot of stuff to decorate my car so i'm just going to show you guys what i got i'm going to show you guys all the features that's in it and what my car looks like and yeah, I'm super excited. This is my first big purchase. So I'm just going to get straight to the video, get straight to decorating the car. I know that's what you guys are really excited to see if you clicked on this video. And yeah. So this is what the trunk looks like. It's pretty spacious. I bought this organizer from Amazon for my trunk because um, I have a lot of stuff. I also bought this thing. It's a versatile unit that puts air in your tires or anything you need to put air in. It comes with like different nozzles depending on what the object is you're putting air in. It also comes with a jumper cable because it comes with a jumping unit. So it comes with its own jumping cord. Um, it also comes with uh, ports to charge anything like your phone or anything. And then it comes with a light, emergency light. So it's like a whole versatile unit that I made sure I needed to get, especially me, me being a female. So I have all my sprays, my vacuum right here and the unit I was just talking about. Then I have my towels that I use to clean my car with. Shoe bags right there. I have my length roller for my dog whenever she's with me. And the thing comes with a whole lot of pockets here on the side and all the way around. So I'm just gonna push it back there. And this is what the trunk looks like with just the organizer, still a lot of space. And of course, I have to have my Belin license plate covers. <laughs> be organized in my car i bought this little bag from tj maxx um i want to put like personal stuffs in here i already have a few feminine stuff in here some perfume sprays pain pills you know for when the time of the month comes and i may need it and i also just want to put a few more stuff in here just in case like a just in casey type of bag and I'm just going to put it in my um, inner console compartment. I got this little registration booklet for my registration papers, my insurance paper, and like other things you could put in here. And then I got these little diamond Honda symbol to put in the middle of my steering wheel. I also got these little diamond hooks to uh, hang my purse. I have a sparkling cover to put over the push to start button and then because i carry around this big jug of water this is my faithful water cup these cup holders can't hold them so i got this um attachable cup holder or whatever you want to call it that you put in the cup holder and it's just a bigger cup holder to hold bottles like this also got my bling cover steering wheel
Okay, so when you first walk up to the car, you can either put your fingers in it to open it or tap on the door to close it. So, and when you first open the car, right here, you have on the doors, your, your windows, the window lock, the car locks, buttons to move the mirrors, left and right mirrors to choose which, which mirrors you're moving. Then down here, you have the trunk button to open the trunk. Then down here, you have the, I haven't used this yet. I'm assuming you pull it. I don't wanna, yeah, you pull it to open the hood of the car. Floor mats I just put in. You have the seat, the buttons to move the seat. That one moves the, the chair up. This one moves the seat back and forth. And this one uh, moves the back of your seat like this part then you have the steering wheel as you can see it is a push to start An additional screen right there so if I press home that's what happened and you can use this little uh, scroller button to scroll through your options I could press this to also put my music here. So I'll just press the button. And it'll show me what's showing me on the screen right here. And then you have these three buttons. When your phone is connected, you can answer or in calls or answer in calls. You press this when you want to speak and say like, call so-and-so. And then on this side, you have this button to, uh, I guess, increase or decrease the sensitivity of how close you are to a car. This button to help you stay in lane. All these other buttons that I don't really know too much about. Then you have your gears or your shifters, whatever you call them when you put the car in sports mode. And you have your regular handles for the high beams, your front lights, uh, windshield wipers, down here, we are up to date, so we got buttons instead of the whole shift. So you got the park, the reverse, neutral, drive, either put the car in econ or sport mode, and you have your brake. Then you got the cup holders, and then right here, just push it, and you can put lay your phone flat here, and it'll charge the phone. You have a outlet right there we have heated seats for the driver and the passenger and then you just have your regular um, AC heater and everything that goes on here and of course you have the screen here you have where you can go home and has options to um, call people um, Bluetooth the serious mode the other uh, radio station check your messages and all that good stuff your volume this car also comes with a camera with reverse parking so when I press the reverse button it has a camera and you can and it has different angles I guess you can view the back camera that way or that way sorry I'm in the garage we have our middle console so for right now, I just have my chapstick right here. You can slide it or take it out. I have my hand sanitizer, my car spray, and the little uh, bag I told you guys about. Glove compartment. I have spare masks. And my little registration booklet pen. Up here you have your glasses holder, um, your regular lights, we have the button for our sunroof right here. So I'll show you. So that button, you can either push it to just open the window or 
you can slide it toward you can slide the button towards you to open the whole entire window And then in the back, you just have a regular back seat, clear mats. Yep. But you also have little charging outlets for your passengers right here. Yeah, so that's basically it. It's very spacious, roomy. Um, you have your cup holders for the back. Um, a light. I got my little hooks for my bag.